Hey everybody, it's Christina from Creations with Christina and we're going to be making a Father's Day card today and I just wanted to show you quickly the cartridges I used. I used the, the um, designer's calendar and elegant edges and I just have them um, here on my iPad just so I could show you it's a lot easier um, than showing you on the Gypsy what images I used. So under the designer calendar on page 44 I used the Dad's Day on the events uh, feature key and I cut that out at 1.79 and under the Elegant Edges cartridge, I cut out the image on page 63 in the uh, um, oblong shape in the shadow of the oblong. Um, those are cut out at 3.70, which is 3.70 um, in height, as well as the other one for the um, Dad's Day, that was 1.70 in, um, in height as well. So, so let's go ahead and get started uh, putting our card together. So the first thing we're going to do is work with our um, images and I have all my pieces right here for my card and I thought what we would do is just start off with my pieces that I cut out with my Cricut cartridge or my Cricut rather. So for the Dad's Day I'm just going to go ahead and um, grab my tweezers and my two-way glue pen and I'm just going to go ahead and hear that down in the center of my little frame here. So I'll just add the to a glue to the back and then I'm going to center that right on to this gray piece right here. I just want to make sure I'm pretty straight. And the next thing I'm going to do is just take um, my piece here and layer that onto um, the dark gray piece of cardstock that I cut out, which is the shadow piece to my frame. So I'm just going to go ahead and center that right on there. And then I'm going to add some brads right into the four corners. So I have my little um, foam mat and my paper piercer. So I'm just going to go ahead and just poke my, my holes here in the corners. And then I'm going to go ahead and add the brads to the corners. Okay, so that's my frame put together, and now what I'm going to do is start putting together the base of my card. So I'm just going to set that aside for now. Um, I have a piece of this dark gray, smoky gray cardstock from Paper Tray Ink, and this is cut at four and a quarter by eleven. And we're going to go ahead and do a score line at five and a half. I'm just going to go ahead and. Fold that in half and just use my bone folder to make a nice crease and I'll go ahead and put that away. So the next thing I'm going to do is I have a piece of pattern paper. This is a darker gray pattern paper and I'm using all of my pattern papers coming from this um, my, my, mind's, my Mind's Eye Stella Rose paper collection. It's a 6x6 six six pad so it's got some great um, colors in it and a lot of masculine kind of colors. So I'm going to go ahead and adhere that down, but before I do that, I'm going to start building building my um, images here. So I cut another piece of this uh, pattern paper that I used for the background um, for the bottom, and this piece uh, measures four inches by one and a half. So I'm going to go ahead and adhere that down. just like that. And then the next thing I want to do is I have a little piece of um, the same colored cardstock that I'm using for the background of or the base of my card. Um, I have a piece of that and I'm going to use this new um, punch that I just picked up. It's the postage, postage stamp Fisker's punch. So I'm just going to go ahead and punch um, a little border edge for this. So I punched this and I trimmed it down a little bit and I'm just going to go ahead and adhere that down um, right along the uh, piece of paper that I put down the bottom here. So I'm just going to use my two-way glue pen just to put the adhesive on the back. And 
and then I'll just run that right along the piece of that pattern paper. Alright, so the next thing I want to do is I have a piece of black ribbon and I'm just going to go ahead and trim this down a little bit and I'm going to put that straight across the front um, of my card and then I'll adhere the um, dad's day right to the top there. So I'm just going to go ahead and flip this over. I'm going to line it up. Flip it over and then I'll use my ATG gun to put adhesive down to adhere those pieces down. Make sure I'm still straight going across. Okay. And then what I'll do is to go ahead and adhere that down to the front of my card base. So I'm just going to go ahead and line this up on my card. Just like that. And then I'll go ahead and add my Dad's Day frame here. I'm just going to use some pop dots on the back. And then that will get centered right on the front of my card. So there's my card for today. Thanks for watching another episode of Creations with Christina. I'll see you next time. Bye.